Hello guys, today I will talk about the Temple Legacy 1, Temple Legacy 2, I'm sorry, in a blue and green colorway. So I have here my Temple Legacy, I've been using for at least one month. So today I will review about the durability perspective. First of all, I use the spray, pen spray to make the default black in the back side of the color. And the bottom side also so I really regret to black out my football boots like this because it not stay long longer within time and then uh, but although that it looks a bit uh, fair to me even if it's not so beauty at all first of all I really use my better cream this is the cream i use to protect my leather so it says here shoes norris protects for leather shoes give leather leather vinyl vinyl leather vinyl high gloss with antifungal so it has a three function first it gives a shining look of your leather boots uh, second it's protect from scuff like if you hit someone try to hit uh, your shoes with uh, studs and it will have a really smooth surface and then it will not affect your shoes or your leather soccer shoes and then the third one is from antifungal because leather is a natural substance or natural material time to time because it's made from animal maybe or maybe just perhaps it will develop fungus or anything microbial but so far I don't really experience the problem maybe if you have the problem the material firstly it will harden and impact your touch on the ball secondly it smells no good right all right guys so back to my review at first glance, I see no sole separation because the toe box here has been modified by Nike and it stays uh, really really good in here. But my problem only arises uh, when it you play it, I play it in the rain or mud, so it the sole separation begin to occur but not really uh, really seen but you can feel it once you try fit your shoe and then you can feel the edges like not a ripping but just a little gap yeah you can see it's a gap right but it doesn't impact your performance on le uh, shoes especially legacy my thought on Legacy, I think this is a very very great shoe. It has the potential to be a first grade shoes because firstly it is lighter than the Legend. Second, it has ha it has the same amount of leather padded. And this the leather it provides it's much more softer than the Legend, firstly if you buy. But after a month of use, you can tell the difference between a kangaroo leather and the calf skin. So I have here, this is my Morelia Molded FG, it's a classic football boot, it's made from the kangaroo leather, so you can see it's really really soft here, super soft, and these football boots I have used for one, one month also, but only if I play in a good weather condition, if not I didn't use because I really love this boot. And I didn't want to mess with the leather, so you can see the shining. It's really shiny, really softer because I already break in the shoe. It's had a lot of box, and you can compare it with the Legacy here. Same size, nine UK, uh, ten US, and twenty eight cm. So you can see because I have this shoe, shoe three, and I didn't use it. So when I remove it, you can see. The leather, the softness, it's very, 
and when you when you press it you can see the crease so it has a stitching but the stitching didn't impact the appearance of the leather stitching only uh, when you fit your foot on your shoes and when you use use the shoes you can feel if you have stitching it will limit your movement uh, and it will stay the leather stay like that every time impact you make touch on the ball or anything or you've been tack been tackled this the leather stay true and didn't widen much but if you have this it's only a minimal stitching you can see sometimes it getting softened but sometimes it getting hardened but the internal support catch really supports your feet inside also the back of the shoe it has a grippy synthetic leather but you didn't feel it much at all and you can use this shoe also on the artificial ground although it's not recommended but I think it will stay okay as long as you don't over force or use this shoe for high impact like tackle like that so it will, it will stay like that so personally I really love this boot this is a really really great shoes it's super softer it feels like a premium leather um, compared to the Puma King I think this is a really great shoe it's better than Puma King so I play as a midfielder sometimes a goalkeeper I really love the touch it you feel when you shoot you feel some slight amount of padding but still not a bare foot and it, the lead is light when it's rain it's not soak well, water too much so far so good so I really recommend for you guys if you have tighter budget just buy this shoe on the sale and you never really disappointed with the quality durability as long as you take care your football boots with your leather cream or sh your any type of foliage that protects your leather from scarf or microbacterial so that you can really experience the better touch all over the game all over a longer period of time okay thanks for watching